Butorphanol's trade name is Statol. It's important not so much for what it is used for, but rather to illustrate the concept of partial agonist. Butorphanol is a partial agonist at the mu receptor. It has a lower efficacy at the mu receptor than full agonist. Morphine is a full agonist also at the mu receptor. So what happens? Well, in the presence of a full opioid agonist, butorphanol competes for mu receptors with morphine, but it isn't as good at activating the G-protein coupled receptor, so there's less of an opioid effect. Taken to the extreme, this can cause withdrawal symptoms if the patient was previously taking a full opioid agonist. It is as effective as morphine when it comes to relieving moderate pain, but it is less effective for alleviating severe pain. Butorphanol is also a mixed action opioid, meaning in addition to binding at the mu receptor, it also binds to the kappa receptor. The good thing is that butorphanol and other partial agonist drugs have less likelihood of causing a certain side effect. What is that side effect? Respiratory depression. So you have less respiratory depression with partial agonists.